Inserting a logo into Word document is a piece of cake. So you just need to do two or three actions and you will be done. So you need to watch this video very carefully because it's a very short tutorial. And at the end, if you find some value, do give it a like. So we start our tutorial. So the inserting a logo is like inserting a picture in the Word document because you will download your uh, logo uh, in the form of a picture. So what you need to do is that you need to click on this insert tab and then click on the picture and from the drop down menu you need to click this device. If your um, logo is available online you should download it or otherwise you have to select this online pictures and stock images that will going to be a little difficult. So I would highly recommend that you first download your logo onto your PC and then you follow these steps to click this device and then browse the folder in which your logo is available. Here is mine. Click on that and click insert. So the logo depending upon the size of the logo you will see the um, large or a small image as you can see right now my image is of quite large dimension. So what we need to do is that we need to decrease the size of this logo and move it to the desired location. So first of all, I would recommend you to <coughs> uh, click from any of the corners and then start to reduce its size. So if uh, you do not have this practice, then you can click on the image and then go here in the size tab, click on this arrow and then from here make sure that the lock aspect is selected. Click OK and now from here you can reduce the image size. So I think this is enough. Now the next thing that you have to do is that you would see that your image or logo is not moving here and there. So for that you need to click on this icon which is which pops up um, towards the top right hand side which is a layout option. So and from here you need to select any of this with the text wrapping. So I'm just going to select this one and then you would see that your logo would start to move. Now you can take this logo to a place where you want it to be. Let's say I want this to be on the top right hand side. So I'm just going to put it there and maybe I can click this. Uh, I can take this uh, heading uh, below the logo. So let me show you the print preview. As you can see that it is on the top right hand side. Still if there is anything left, uh, you can ask me in the comment section and I'll try to make another tutorial on that or try to answer you in within the comment section. Thanks for watching.